Tim's Tiny Arcade, where today we're going to be looking at the Pandora 5S. It's an arcade machine that plays 999 games, and I got a special guest today on the show. Hey, I'm Lucas. That's my nephew. He's going to be helping me test out some of these games because we got a lot of two-player games we can test out, and we're going to test the controls and see how these games hold up. Here's a look at the Pandora 5S. I got the Street Fighter version, and here's the game list. I'm just going to go through this real quick. We have a lot of arcade games on here, a lot of side beat em ups. Lots and lots of games. Got a lot of King of Fighter games, almost a whole page of those. Marvel games. Just some uh, Metal Slug. A lot of Metal Slug games. There's some duplicates on here from time to time. There are a few duplicates. But you can get these on uh, eBay. I purchased this one and got it for about $175 shipped. So for the amount of games you're getting for that price, as long as they hold up and look good. I've played a few of these so far and I've enjoyed them. But it's going to take a while to play all these games. Superman was there. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. WWF series. And there we go. All 999. All right, so here's some footage of the Punisher, the arcade game. Controls are very easy. Very... You just press A and move the joystick around and you're all set. Yeah, we played this game a couple weeks ago up in Chicago. As far as the graphics look, it's pretty similar to it. I mean, uh, I can't see a lot of difference. Yeah, almost identical to the game in Ch uh, Galloping Ghost in Chicago. Alright, we'll jump into another game. All right, here's WWF WrestleFest. Yep. And I used to play this game back in the day, and this looks almost exactly like it. Very fun game to play. I'm a huge wrestling fan. Right now we're playing the... The Battle Royal, Royal Rumble kind of type. So you got to throw them over the top rope. Yeah, I mean, once again, the controls are very easy. Uh, as long as you press the A button, you should be good. I am Earthquake, so I'm the big blue guy. Can I go up top? Oh, I can go up top. So yeah, you might want to put some joystick action. And B, you can jump on somebody. So yeah, the controls are simple. Graphics are great. Gameplay is fun. I would say all in all, this is a fun system to play. All right, so we're going to do a classic here. We're going to do Donkey Kong. See how this plays. It looks identical to the original game. Yeah, it's it's hard, just like the original game. Let's see if I can make it to the top without dying. My final thoughts on the Pandora 5S is definitely I think it's worth the money. I mean, for the, the cost and all the games you get, um, I think it's almost a no-brainer. Luke, did you enjoy playing this? I really enjoyed playing this. It was like revisiting an arcade. Yeah, I think I might have a hard time getting him out of the arcade, my arcade today. But hey, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the video. Until next time, we'll see ya.